who's here. Uh, Jen- Jennifer Robb is the president of Hunter College, and she's got this great New York State mentorship program. Jennifer, welcome to the show. How are you this morning? Good morning. It's wonderful to be with you. Oh, you know, I think it's great. I have a dear friend who you probably know, and I hope he doesn't mind me mentioning his name. His name is Raymond Chambers, and he is a a, a god like to us, a saint, a true saint. Let me say he's a saint in Jersey. He talked about mentoring 25 years ago. You got to mentor, you got to mentor. So God bless you for taking this on in New York State. Tell us about the New York State Mentorship Program. We are very lucky to partner with the New York State Mentoring Program to bring them and our students to a public school in East Harlem. And as you know, Joe, the East Harlem community faces many challenges. It has some of the highest uh, levels of diabetes, of asthma, um, educational underperformance. And the school that we're working in is a pre-K through 8 And there's so much need among the children. There's a high homeless population living in public housing. And what the mentoring program allows us to do is create one-to-one support for these young children. We've started in fourth grade, and we have six Hunter College students who come up once a week to meet with a fourth grader. And the students get direction from the teachers about perhaps what the child is struggling with in the classroom or some issue in the child's life. Yeah. And they work. I love this. Jennifer, I'm sorry, uh, Madam President. Is is this Matilda? I I love that. I love saying Madam President. (laughs) It sounds good. Come on. You you must like that one. (laughs) (laughs) Not bad. (laughs) Jennifer, is this Matilda Cuomo's program? This is um, a wonderful partnership with Mrs. Cuomo, who is truly one of the most generous, spirited, um, really visionary people. And as I know you know, she came up with the concept of supporting students one-to-one through mentorship when her husband was governor. And she was very smart to approach her son when he became governor and said, let's renew this program. We know it works. We know that when students have that one-to-one relationship, it's a bit of a friend, it's a bit of a mentor, it's a bit of a teacher, and there's somebody special in their life that for that hour a week is focusing on that young child's development. And that was something Mrs. Cuomo started in New York State and actually brought around the country to other first ladies in different states. And we're so proud that we're helping her now um, rejuvenate yeah. this program yeah. in East Harlem. Yeah, yeah. I'll tell you, Matilda Cuomo is a magnificent gal. She truly is a magnificent person that gives back, smart and wonderful and warm. So this is a very much a nonpartisan program, yes? Oh, absolutely. And when she talked to me about this program that she wanted to you know, re- revigorate, I said how perfect to bring it to East Harlem. And she has been with us from the very beginning, helping us structure it, helping us create the training, because the college students also need some training in how to work appropriately with fourth graders. I love this. Program mentors for over 10,000 children. Is that what I'm reading here? That's what Mrs. Cuomo's goal is, is to really replicate this. And I'm very proud that Hunter College is at the forefront. And I'm, you know, telling people in the CUNY system to look at the work we're doing and try to do this kind of work in their communities. Because, Joe, one of the things that it's a a two-way process, because the students that from Hunter College are Mm -hmm. getting so much out of this as well. One of our students will be a teacher. That's her course of study. Another is a young woman who wants to be a pediatrician. Another is someone studying psychology. And all of these students are getting hands-on experience of working with children and children who have needs, who need the attention. So they now have service credit, and they have a new experience in their lives. Um, And one of the young men said to us very poignantly, I feel so good about being able to give to a young child. I wish that I had this a mentor when I was growing up. Well said. Jennifer Robb, president of Hunter College. Madam President, thank you very much. God bless you and Godspeed. Anything we could do. Joe, I know that you <laughs> yes. work with big, the Big Sister Big Brother program, yeah, and yeah, I think that's sure. wonderful yep. as well because you really understand that giving back to young people. 
We, and also as the spokesperson for the Boys and Girls Clubs in New Jersey, and we, we see people from very stressed areas, Jennifer, very stressed areas, and, and they can't, and they're into situations, to your point earlier, that they can't help, whether uh, the parent is incarcerated, or there is a drug addiction problem, or that the parent has to work. People right. forget. And that's, that's both a, family... a big problem, that both parents work, and they work long hours. Exactly right. This is a great program. Jennifer, we are here for you in anything that you need. Well, thank you so much, and thank you for this opportunity to spread the word. Okay, Jennifer. Be well, Robert, take care. Indeed, you as well. President of Hunter College. Piscopo in the morning.